baseball games, Blue Jays, Blue Jays games, and then some type of fun bar. There's so many awesome bars to go to in the city. I kind of like an active date, so maybe hopping on a bike and riding along the boardwalk. The ROM or the AGO are a lot of fun, and then walking around New Yorkville. Oh, here, for sure. Uh, have you tried the pizza, the macaroni and cheese with truffle oil, the macaroons? I love Morocco, it's beautiful. The last time I was here, I stayed at the Drake which I loved, um, and that was really nice. I guess maybe I would go to the Drake, because the rooftop bar was really nice, so maybe you would have a few cocktails on the roof, and then maybe a little wander around. And there was a poutine place right nearby, which uh, could be a good snack for afterwards. A good Canadian snack on a good Canadian date. Yeah. Well, when I was in high school, I really liked this guy, and he like traveled with bands, and so I would go to every concert within like 7,000 miles to like casually drop by and see him. Um, I lived in Central America for a crush. I didn't travel there for him. Well, I did. I, yeah, Central America, Guatemala. So in the UK, in Paris, in uh, Warsaw, in Kosovo, and in New York City. The furthest I've ever traveled for a crush is. Um, I'm quite lazy, not terribly far. Changed my hair color. Oh, I chopped off all my hair. I got a tattoo to forget him and be done with him, and it was about moving on and, you know, grasping my bravery or something. The most drastic move to New York, probably. That was kind of drastic. I was going to say I got a tattoo, but um, then I moved to New York, and that's a little bit further, so probably that, yeah. <laughs> Vegas and Paris. Going to those two places. I think I divide it into sections. There would be happiness, work, and health. And under each of those, I'd have to do is like find a great guy, do a career that you love, uh, save enough money so that you're not homeless when you're 70. The last time I had a to do list for myself, it was basically to make me try new things. And I think that's really important because. Um, it's so easy to get in a rut. Think of something that you've always, always wanted to do but never, ever done, and um, just do it. Just don't worry about it. Dye your hair, it will grow back. Like, get a tattoo, you can cover it up. You know, just do it. Me and Nike. I'm having so much fun. Everyone is so lovely, and the venue is beautiful. It's, they did an excellent job on coordinating with my dress without even knowing. So, full props to the venue. Yeah, thank you. Well, thank you, it's all for you. Thank you.